Hey guys, welcome back. DreamReaver23 here with another Let's Play episode. And who smacked me? <laughs> I'll take it that was yeah. Chris. Chris. Uh, so I am joined as usual by Chris. Howdy. And Steve. What's up? Well, actually, I can't say as usual since the last video. Chris wasn't here because his internet sucks. And the video before that, here. Steve wasn't here. So, uh, Steve's here less than I was. Well, I guess Steve was here for like 10 minutes. The one before that. Steve is tired. Hey, zip it. I got to work yeah, in the morning. You know what? That's great. <laughs> I got to sleep in the morning. Let me see this light. So for those of you who don't know, we did make in the last episode we went through, or actually bef in between the last episode and the one before that, we made a 360 valve redstone engine. We dubbed the name a MEP, or a Massive Energy Producer. Uh, I had somebody comment, uh, Culver, 1000 or something like that commented on my last <laughs> video and he was like yeah when are you gonna guys gonna make another 120 valve engine redstone engine thing it's it's been dubbed the mep uh so that's uh that's what this is there's 360 of them it's bigger and badder than the other one um are y'all making sexual advances towards each other no Going away off into a nice dark corner. Off into the dark corner. <laughs> so that's what this is. This is the 360 valve redstone engine massive energy producer or MEP. So if you see us say MEP or hear us say MEP, we're referring to this big, huge, monstrous beast mode thing down here below. Um, it's a nice, solid line it's outputting. Yeah, yeah, it does. It does really good. It doesn't doesn't falter. So, in the last episode, we built a wheat farm and we had it powered by the MEP. Who just leaves the door open? We got some people on, man. We got uh, what we're running eleven people, twelve people, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, thirteen. Thirteen people on the server right now. Wow. Uh, so good stuff on there. We're getting uh, on average anywhere from one to three. Uh, people a day subscribing to the server so pretty excited about that uh but last time we were on here we did make a wheat farm and we're going to show that off right here it's over here producing and doing well <gasps> way to go little wheat farm did you guys know that you can hold down the right button and it is like a defensive maneuver with the sword yeah yeah I have no clue you'll have to pardon steve apparently That's he's so new cool. to the game <laughs> that's so cool oh man you should attack me do it attack me right now dick <laughs> you said attack me. uh now so we're gonna go through and this episode i was like okay what can we do what can we do uh well we want to start building some of the ic2 stuff but for the ic2 stuff uh for those of you who don't know industrial craft 2 uh we need to have a lot of rubber um and and sticky resin to make the rubber and everything like that so I said, well, let's go ahead and make a rubber tree farm. Steve actually has one over at his house that he's using. And so we were going to go, and we checked it's that nice. out a little bit earlier. Very nice. And so we got a little plot set up out there, and we're going to go through and make a rubber tree farm. Now, we did go through because we've had a lot of resources from going and spelunking. Um, I get mixed reviews whenever people say, well, you know, if we do a spelunking video, they either like it or they don't like it. And so mo more people are saying, you know, we want to see you actually building stuff and giving those tutorials and whatnot. So we did go through with our supplies that we had from before and then going and finding some more supplies. We went and uh, we kind of got things set up so we can go down the list and make everything for it. So we're going to go through and start this out. Now for a rubber tree farm, there's a lot of uh, things that you need to make to actually create the rubber tree farm. And there's a lot of things that you need. So we wanted to go through and kind of just start out from the base, the get-go. Um, and you can see my little character over here. Whenever he goes over here, he's kind of looking at the recipes. I have them pulled up on the side. If you guys are looking for the recipe, recipes, I'll put a link in the description below. But it's forestry. The, the recipes, actually. You were correct the first time. Yeah, totally correct. Uh, Forestry.syngear.net slash wiki slash index php blah 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 it's a lot of crap but i'll put the link down in the uh description below because at first i was just trying to look for wiki forestry and that didn't work uh so first we're going to go through and the first piece of the equipment that we're going to need is a rubber farm uh to make a rubber farm you use four glass four rubber wood and one uh arboretum and so we're actually going to start off because the arboretum the glass and the rubber wood obviously we know how to get that but the Arboretum, we actually have things kind of set up. 
And so we're going to need uh, to make uh, the Arboretum. You actually have to make a starter machine, four glass and four gold ingots. And you don't have my gold ingots in here. It's not gold. You oh, do not have my gold that's ingots gold in there. gold ingots. My bad. I was totally thinking that was a... Uh... Well, this is to make brass, and I do need to make the brass out of this. Okay, well... So I'm going to go ahead and do this. I was thinking those were brass, not gold. I wasn't paying attention enough, I guess. So, in one of the chests so over there, we actually have some uh, gold ingots over there. <laughs> so we're going to go through, and one we're going to make... We need to organize, Dream. You have this crap organized awfully. It's just kind of throw it in there. So the copper tin, copper and tin, three copper and one tin equals four uh, bronze four ingots. Holding it up. Uh, while y'all are doing that and playing around over there, I'm going to make the sturdy machine. Eight bronze ingots uh, in, a, in a circle, in a square around the center makes a sturdy machine. There you go. And I magically have... Three, three. Now gold you ingots. Have four. <laughs> okay. okay. <There laughs> I magically go. have three gold ingots. Ah, oh, too bad I need four. Uh, so we're going to put our sturdy machine in the middle. So this is going to make the arboretum. You put the sturdy machine in the middle. You put your glass uh, top, bottom, left, and right. And you put your gold ingots that magically appear in my inventory uh, in the four corners. And that gets you an arboretum. And then to the next one, we go to the rubber farm. <clears throat> We have it laid out as this. So we use one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four. Four rubber wood, four glass, and an arboretum. So we're going to lay that out here. Dun, 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 dun. I think I just popped my sternum. That was really painful. Nice. Sorry, you guys. That was completely off topic. But... <laughs> nah, it's cool, man. I'm pretty sure that has nothing to do, to do with forestry. But All right, so next up, uh, besides Moan My Name uh, from Chris, we have the rubber tree harvester that we're going to be making. Oh, my name. <laughs> <laughs> now, with the rubber tree farm, uh, or the rubber tree harvester, we actually, uh, it's an expensive one. Uh, we do need to make uh, one sturdy machine, and, or actually we need to make one logger, and uh, we need four saplings and four glass. So to make the logger, we're going to go in right here, we have this set up. We need to make a sturdy machine, another one, ding, 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 ding. and we'll take this glass and these diamonds. These diamonds, we did actually go down and mine these diamonds. We haven't mined much, but we've mined enough for the diamonds. We actually only have one left after we're done with this entire setup, so. <laughs> nice. Lies and slanders. Lies and slanders and libel and something. Uh, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So, yeah, we need to get a quarry up. I just wanted to start with the forestry stuff. <laughs> And we're going to put the sturdy machine in the center. We're going to put the glass top, bottom, left, right, and the diamonds in the corner. And that's going to make us our logger. We're going to go over here to the rubber tree farm, or rubber tree harvester. I keep saying farm. We're going to grab our rubber tree saplings and our glass. <clears throat> Did you take it down? <laughs> All I hear is them fighting in the background. So the four rubber tree saplings in the corners, the glass in the up, down, left, right, and the logger in the center gets us our rubber harvester. Uh, next, we're going to actually be making the automatic tree tap. <clears throat> now, the automatic tree tap, uh, this extracts the uh, and drops the resins from the resin holes on the IC2 trees. Um, it's so nice. And it actually puts them... the into a chest and everything for you. It kind of goes there and puts that down. Uh, it does have to be powered uh, to be operative, but the output of the uh, an electrical engine, or as we're going to put it, our MEP, uh, should be should enough be to keep sufficient. it working. Yeah, should be well enough to keep should it working. Should be. What, what are you doing over here? Are you have to be bad I I think you should just have to type. You shouldn't be allowed to talk. <laughs> Oh, jeez. All right. Hey, 
Okay. So to make the automatic tree tap, we do need one starting machine, four glass, and four tree taps. So we'll go ahead yeah, and yeah. grab the rest of this out of here. Make another sturdy machine. Lots of sturdy machines being used. So will you stop fighting back there? I can't. Stop I can't record for five stream. minutes without you fighting back in the background. Don't make me pull this server over. I will do it. That Don't make me get your mother. Joke, you guys, I'm sorry. <laughs> that was definitely a dreams joke. He said it first a while ago. <laughs> I feel it's bad. Okay. <laughs> so it's it's all right. It's okay. It sounded funnier when I said it. Not really. Bye. And by sounded funnier, I mean it sounded <laughs> more gay and therefore funnier because now I sound funny. Because when Super Steve talks, everyone listens. No? Hey, Dream. You smell funny. Oh, yeah? Ah. <laughs> I, I like using the control. It's like, boom, right in your face. I'm looking at you. You want to go, mister? Yeah. Yeah, I bet you do. Yeah. It's it's like those creepy pictures that are just like. It's like you guys are out. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Look at those eyes. No. Ow! Start working. <laughs> okay, sorry. <laughs> 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 All right. Uh, finally, guys, we're going to make the Forester. Which the Forester, I will actually have you explain. Actually, no. Before we make the Forester, let's make the Forester efforts. Let's make some hummus. Or humus. I think it's actually humus, because hummus has two M's. So, I, I don't know. That's humorous. That's true. All right, so there's two ways of making humus, uh, or hummus, or whatever you want to call it. We'll say humus. Uh, humus is uh, can be made with appetite um, and some other junk. But since we have the wheat farm, we actually have plenty of wheat over here. And seeds now. <laughs> Way to go. So we have plenty of wheat right coming there. from uh, the stuff over there, <laughs> just in case we want to start up another wheat farm. So we wanted to show you how to make uh, humus <laughs> out of out of out of out of wheat. So we're gonna set this up. We'll split this right here and grab our stuff, and then we're gonna grab all this dirt. Oh, we're laughing at the private chat. All right. So, to make manure is what you're going to make first. You're going to take wheat, and you're going to set it up in the up, down, left, right position. We're going to take the dirt and put it in the middle, and that's going to give us four manure for each one. So we're going to shift-click on there so we can get all of that out. Now, to make the... Uh, bum, 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 bum. Uh, so that's to make manure. To make the uh, humus, you actually take the manure set it in the center, and you surround it by dirt on all the sides. This is the tedious process. Dun, 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 dun. And we have eight humus produced for each one. Why are you throwing basalt cobblestone to me? Always messing with me. Dude, that made a lot of the humus. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight stacks of humus now. Wow. Take those back. <clears throat> All right, so we have our rubber plantation. We have our rubber harvester. We have the tree tap. We have tons of humus. We also have our power teleport pipes and everything that we made for the wheat farm and uh, golden conductive pipes. We have rubber tree saplings. We should be good to go. But it's nighttime. Z. We just wait for everybody to sleep. God, take forever. Oh. If you're not near a bed, type. I can just kick them all. Slash AFK. <laughs> Good night, Humpy. <laughs> um.
There we go. <clears throat> so we'll cut most of that out, or maybe not. No, nope. depending on how Dream feels. No, nope, because I just started rendering tonight, so I can put it up in the morning. Do 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 do. Oh, I'm not here, by the way. I'm not here by the plot of land we set up. <clears throat> Look at that sunrise. That is a nice sunrise. <laughs> Learn how to spell breakfast. Find you. <laughs> Shwa. You want to fill in those holes? <laughs> I know you got some dirt on you. <clears throat> Alright, so we did set this up as the middle point. Yay, middle point, because I'm very anal about it and I uh, need stuff set up exactly. Call him anal boy. No, I'm good. Okay. I'm still going to call you anal boy. <laughs> Alright, as long as I can call you Super Steve! Sounds good to me. No, don't call me anal boy. I will kill you. <laughs> All right, so... Whatever you say, little boy. <laughs> okay, now I'm done. I'm sorry. That's probably going to be edited out. <laughs> probably a good idea. Yeah. <clears throat> All right, and we'll come back to the part that we're going to edit out afterwards from here. So, with that being said right there, um, <laughs> it is morning now. Why are you throwing me dirt? I don't need dirt. The tree tap. How does the tree tap set up? So we're going to go through and set this up on here and pop that down. Uh, is the rubber harvester or the rubber plantation the one got to be in the center? Uh, it's the rubber plantation. All right. So we'll set the rubber plantation down. And the rubber harvester goes right beside it. Yes. Let's see. And the tree tap. Where's that one go? Tree tap can go anywhere around the three, two. Usually it's best to put the harvester in the middle, not the harvest. yeah, the harvester in the middle? No, not the harvester in the middle, the, uh, whatchamacallit in the middle, the planter. Okay, and then put the, tr the harvester on one side or whatever, or the log yeah. or whatever it's called, and the tree tap on the other? Yeah. All right. <clears throat> so, now, in this slot we provide hummus. And this slot we provide trees. Do we have to provide sand? No, that's an output. So it outputs sand. Yes, we already had this discussion, Dream. True, but I forget. <laughs> I have a bad memory from the army. Okay. Uh, let's see. That, and I'm sure our you know viewers would like to know as well. I oh, know. I was just messing with you. Uh, oh, we should have. I think we have some diamond filter uh, pipes up there. In the house. Yeah. If you can grab. Uh, do we just we'll just need yeah, one of those, right? I don't know where they are. I'm gonna go look for them. You've got to really organize this. Yeah, I know. We need to get that done. We'll if we'll we'll do that before next episode. How about that? All right. Because we also need to get our uh, quarry going, and so maybe next episode we will get the chest organized and get them kind of place, and then we'll set up the quarry and have it to where it's filtering everything like we did before. How about that? All right. Whatever. <clears throat> All right, so I do know not a lot. <laughs> it's it's true, I you know. Well, I'm gonna you go through and provide one, right? power. Uh, yeah, yeah, I should just need one. <clears throat> I'm gonna dig underneath and get some uh, power going. And all three of these need to be power, correct? Yes. All right, so we will get power right here, here, and here. And we'll take our which one? This one's a power teleport pipe. We're did gonna you say put you wanted the item teleport pipe, or did you want the the what should we call it? No, 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 the diamond filter pipe. Okay, right, right, right. All right, that's what that my is. Dirt. Because we don't have any item teleport pipes, if I remember correctly. No, we no, do. I have, I have I them on me. Back. All right, so and that goes on top of that one or this one? So it goes on that. It one. goes on top of this one. Or at least that's the most effective setup that I could find. All right, so I'm going to put it to where we have an item teleport pipe that comes off this way. Maybe, if I can. Which, in case you guys didn't realize, it's uh, it's nice and fixed now. You can actually see them. Yeah, that's. I really like that it works now. Uh, so what is going to be going this way? Is it going to be going sticky resin will be coming out here? Yeah, you want to have sticky resin and rubber wood come out that way. Too bad I don't have any sticky resin or rubber wood, so I guess we'll have to wait at first. 
Okay, we'll just put something like... We'll put the tree saplings in the uh, other one. Okay. Do you have a tree I'll... sapling? <laughs> no. And you don't have to spread these out. You can stack those and they'll work fine. I don't know what comes out the side, though. Do you have any normal teleport... Uh, not teleport pipe. Normal pipe? Will you move? Yeah, do you have any normal pipe? Mm, no. Well, I have I have just stone transport pipe. Is that what you're asking? Yeah, about? that's what I need. Here. There we go. Yellow. <clears throat> okay. And then... The sand is going to come out of what? The sides. Side. So, I need two more of those. There you go. <clears throat> Crap. I'm watching. Well, okay. Usually I have some sort of uh, chest. Not this here chest. So actually. Well, actually, let's put that towards an item teleport pipe. We could have sand going in and going into a furnace to make glass or something. Okay. So this one's the item teleporter. Yeah. Ah, we need to set these up. Okay, so frequency two will be sand. Frequency three will be... What is the frequency of the power pipe? The frequency of the power pipe? I have it set to the right one. I just haven't turned it true yet because I want to get all this set up first. Okay. Right, right. Yep, 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 yep. Just make sure I have these set up right. All right. I dubbed the <laughs> cow slayer. <laughs> Mr. A is probably the funniest person <laughs> on this entire server. I know. I wish he would talk. He never, he just types. He types. That's all he does. Frequency two. Makes frequency me cry three. sometimes a little bit on the inside. Makes me poop a little bit. <clears throat> oh, on the inside. The poop. <laughs> it scares people. And it makes them comment about it on YouTube. It's We've true. had like what three comments, two comments about that something giant like poop that. tower we the, talked the about. The poop statue. <laughs> we might actually go ahead and build that sooner or later. Yes, uh, all out of brown wool. All right, so we have it loaded up now. Uh, we have our rubber farm in the middle, and they are stacked in there. Oh, you did take one out and put it in this thing. Gotcha. So yellow will be going back down with our diamond filter pipe. We'll be going back down, back into the rubber farm. Uh. This is the, the basically, this is what, the, what harvests it, and it will put back there. The Do we have to have anything going off of the little automatic tree tap thing? Or it does it automatically? Like It doesn't have to have anything, any output, any power. Uh, it needs power, that's for sure. Well, it's got power, but, I mean, it doesn't have to have any pipes coming off of it? Uh, it shouldn't, no. Because the logger is what picks everything up. Well, it may not be what picks everything up, but it's where everything comes out of, so. Gotcha. Well, I'm going to go ahead and switch this to true to receive power. And we'll see if we did it right. Ah, power's going. Yeah, this is where I had my problems with the, uh, oh, never mind, it's working. Oh, yeah, it's laying down the hummus, the humus. Humus. H humus. What did you call me? <laughs> Din, din, ch, 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 ch. So this does does this do the three rows as well, just like the uh, the wheat farm? No, it just does two. Oh, okay. And it does a staggered build when it starts laying out the uh, the saplings. However, it does go kind of slowly with uh, the laying out of the ground here. Ah, oh, no worries. This will give us time to make fun of Chris. Yeah, it's a good point. It's mainly because you've got that powering three different oh, machines. It's so. already going through and putting the trees down, too. Yes, yes, it does. It is. <clears throat> well, actually, it's powering four different machines. It's Five. A it's a good point. Didn't think about that. But even still, it's still going a lot faster than three redstone engines. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that took forever. Me and Chris were sitting there for like 30 minutes, like, what the hell? Why isn't it doing anything? <laughs> Nice. Nice, you guys. Please tell me that wasn't in a video. No. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, well, we, we edited, uh, you know, okay. took out parts. Okay. 
It is getting dark, though, if you would like to uh, <clears throat> magically take care of that, Mr. Wizard. So that we can keep this going while it's doing its stuff. So, okay, so it staggers them like that. I gotcha. Yeah. You got me. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Yeah. Monkey. <laughs> well, my name. My name. <laughs> Oh, my name. All right. Now, what you were talking about before was the forester, right? Yes. Notice how these things are just saplings? Well, they're going to stay saplings for a long time. Well, not really a long time. However, they're going to stay saplings for quite a little while. The forester, you put it, basically, you'd put it right here, per se, or not per se, but let's say, in uh, this, not empty space, but yeah, right there. <clears throat> and um, it would, every so often turn on and then turn all of the trees that are currently sitting here into <laughs> full-fledged like full-grown full trees. trees also in case you guys didn't notice um there is a slight discrepancy between the actual trees it lays down and what you see these are rubber rubberwood trees i'll show you by breaking one right here and we'll pick it right back up as you saw it just disappeared it went right here into the machine and is now being put back inside to be planted again. So does it plant it in the same spot? No, it actually continues on planting uh, mm. where it left off of. So, so you're saying you just screwed up our little rotation right there? Oh, get over it. All right. Well, that's while this is going. Let's go ahead and make <laughs> that uh, the Forester. Okay. Do 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 do. It's pretty fast at picking stuff up though. Yeah. Then again, it's not breaking trees at the same time. So. So, Forrester, I'm going to pull this down, and it looks like we're going to need a, <laughs> another Arboretum, which the Arboretum was stuff. Oh, I need more gold. I'm assuming we make another sturdy machine. Yes. And then uh, stuff. <laughs> we're short on gold, by the way, so. All right. We've got 20. Oh, never mind, that's brass. I've got some smelting. Okay. Alright, so we're gonna need... I get, uh, four gold whenever y'all got that ready. It's smelting. No, I need it now! It's my money, and I need... Shut the... <laughs> Calm down over there. There you go. That's right. It's right here. Come get it. Throw it to me. Throw it in my pocket. I'm not your slave. Throw it in my pocket. Ooh. All right. So we have our arboretum. Ow. And then we're going to use that to make our forester. Yeah, where's it at? There it is. Dun, dun, dun. I will smack you. No, you won't. Because right now I'm smacking you. Backing up. Backing up, backing up, backing up, backing up, backing up, still backing up. Oh, I'm dead. I'm going to be dead in like 10 seconds here. Ha. Huh. Come on, I'm backing me. up, backing up, backing up, backing up. <laughs> <laughs> My daddy taught me good. All right. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so <clears throat> four diamonds in the corners, the arboretum in the middle, and your that glass hurt. top, bottom, left, right. <clears throat> we'll get you the forester, which looks just like the uh, other thingy. Automatic tree tab. Yeah, they look very similar. And uh, right, after, right after this, we need to go over how to make the uh, cat list. Ah, that's a good idea. Where's your appetite? It's in the <laughs> third chest. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> There's a creepy growl right behind there, too. Make sure there's no creepers out here. Alright, and I'm going to set this right on top. Right no, you turned all your bones into bone meal. Oh, I lied. Here's some bones. Alright, so we have our forester, and we're going to this, place this right beside the farmer as well. So you kind of have the two of them. This should get powered here in just a second. But we don't have any uh, catalyst in there. And that's what 
Steve was talking about. Let me get back up there. <laughs> so that way people can see how it's made. So I take it the way you're making it is with, uh, how are you making it? The three empty vials? Well, you need three empty vials, which means, well, actually, no, you need three pieces of glass, which means that since you guys have no glass in here, or as far as I remember, do we have any glass? Mm, maybe. I'm smelting some right now. I just got the three, so we don't need the, any more. And here's 58 right here. It's too deep. I don't want 158 glass. Not 158. All right, what you do? I don't need your glass. What's that? I yeah, can't you hear can't, you. You can't actually see this. Um, okay. So, here I'll give you one, two, three vials, a, a bone meal. Well, you just give it back to yourself. Cool. I got glass. All right, what you do is you place that three vials across the middle row. Then um, you do the fertilizer on the bottom row on the outside two pieces, and then a bone in the middle. Okay. And you get three catalysts. <clears throat> Yay. Now what? Now you go put that in the thing. Ah, we got gotcha. you. Yeah. La 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 la. Going to spread my catalyst. Yeah. He's going to spread his seed, then grow it. Mm-hmm, totally am. At a faster rate than usual. So with the catalyst, does that affect all the trees, or is one go for uh, one it tree? It will. No, it will. You'll see. Why is there chicken in there? I'll take that. <laughs> Apparently trees don't like cooked chicken. <laughs> I thought they just hungry. All right, so I put the catalyst in there. It's sitting on the power pipe, and you can now see that it's watch starting it to work. Notice it going up. Right. It's nice, isn't it? It's a nice colored light. It reminds you of home a little bit. Wow. And suddenly the trees are grown. And what you usually want to do after that is you usually want to take it back out and uh, let it just kind of chill. Because otherwise it's going to start growing <laughs> trees into trees and then, then you will lose more saplings, with, especially with a rubber tree farm, than you will actually make so. Yeah, yeah, we, we don't have a here. chest set up on the inside. Here, uh, go set up a chest. I will do no such thing. Wait, there's the item teleport pipes. Which frequencies are these? Uh, this one is frequency two. How could you forget to do that, Dream? That was the one job you had. I'm going to smack you. Yeah, you probably are. I probably should stop speaking. And we got sand coming out as well. And sand is on frequency speaking. three. It's probably a good idea that I'm not speaking anymore. So, you know, especially since I'm done speaking. Well, that was fun. All right, what were the frequencies? Frequency two is for um, resin. And? And frequency three is for sand. <clears throat> There's no pipes connected to frequency three. Oh, you know why? Because they're under my name. This one out here is your name. Like the, the frequency two is, is your name. The frequency three is my name. Way to go. And I'm backing up, backing up, back, damn it. <laughs> All right, I'm going to go in here and set this one for frequency three. That's cool. I love being disconnected. There's 14 people on this server right now. All right, so that one's frequency three. This one's frequency two. All right, I that's that right. Receive true, and those should start coming in and filling that up. Who moved that hill from under my feet? <laughs> I 
All right. And every so every spot that a tree grows turns into a piece of sand. So you lose a piece of humus, gain a piece of sand. And the humus doesn't like rematerialize itself like with the wheat, the dirt no. reusing itself. So you do have to replace the humus every once in a while. Yes, you will have to come out here and physically make more humus. Okay. All right, that's good to know. And so, okay, those are going away. Now, whenever it drops the saplings... Saplings, it will pick it right up and put it in the, back in the machine. All right, we do have this set up to where the saplings are going through yellow and the resin is going through blue, which is good. Mr. Wizard, can you see it's getting a little dark? <clears throat> there we go. Try to keep this to where we can keep it moving through the daytime. Because, uh... <clears throat> I think that was Dream, you cheated in that daytime. You know what? Suck that's it. not legit. That's Suck not legit it. daytime dream. You guys want a video that's, uh, you know, like five hours long? Oh, it's dark. Can't see to record. Hey, Dream, I can't see your screen, but I don't want you to cheat in daytime. Because that's <laughs> cheating. Is there a record light? Yeah, the record light's down here. While this is growing, we'll show you. Hey, Steve, can you start putting fences around the outside? Yeah, I'll go grab some. All right, thank you, thank you, sir. And I'm backing up, backing up, backing up, backing up. <laughs> Let's play recording in session when lit. But only when lit. Yeah, when it's not lit, then people can come in and look around. Oh, that was another question I had. If I join the server, can I go into the Let's Play area and look around? Yeah, yeah, as long as you don't you know, steal or break anything. We're all good with that. Come out, check it out. Uh, we have a lot of people that on the server, because we I think we're up to 27 people on the server now. Um, all together, like subscribers to the server. <clears throat> and so we have it, uh, a lot of them want to come and check out the 360 valve massive engine producer. Energy producer. Massive energy producer. Yeah, that's, that's totally what I said. <clears throat> yeah, definitely, Dream. Definitely. I don't know where I'm at. Um, yeah, I, I got, I got it right here. <laughs> if you want to just fill that in there, Steve. What was that? I, I kind of got one. Got one what? Got one what? Oh, well, damn. <laughs> well, while you were putting up the fence, I decided I'd, I'd make that. How did I miss this? I don't know. Well, you were digging down there, and so I was like right behind you, and that's when I was like, yeah, I got one. But you were already trying to dig up. All right, so since it's done, like going with that round of bit, we need to put more catalyst in there, yes? And I think you have the catalyst. There we go. Nope. Well, you put it in there now. I don't have the catalyst, Dream. So if you don't take it Stop out of there, does it, keep, does it keep trying to push it? Out the yes, catalyst. anytime there's a tree, like a space for the tree to grow, it'll make that tree grow. And the problem with that, with these saplings, any other saplings, it'd be fine. However, the problem with that with these saplings is that, um, excuse me, trees, is that when these grow, since they grow into each other's leaves, and these things only drop a very limited amount of saplings, it's very bad for your output. Right. Understandable. Because you will lose more <clears throat> saplings than you gain. Oh, we got the resin going right through there. That always makes, f makes me laugh whenever it just kind of like drops out of different places. So. <laughs> and I'm back. Damn it. Get out of my head, song. Chris, I blame you for that. I just want you to know. But yeah, I find this to be a, a fairly nice little setup here. Now, you were mentioning something earlier about the, the saplings, like the way they reproduce and everything like that. Yes. Uh, so the, the rubber tree saplings, they're typically one-to-one. -one. They're sometimes like, uh, they're basically like one-to-one, -one, two-to-one ratio, it, about in between, maybe like 1.5. For every one sapling you lay down, you're going to get out like 1.5 rubber trees, which is kind of unrealistic when you think about the number. However, I didn't mean to fall in that hole. Um, you get very few rubber trees with this new update of industrial craft. Except 
right there you can obviously see it just picked up three of them so right yeah see it's going through right next well cool well, guys, so that's how you make the rubber tree harvester. And uh, for guys on my server, I know a couple of you asking were, were asking exactly what goes into the process of making it. And so, and if, if, if you're new to the forestry mod, it does have a lot of really cool stuff, and it does have a lot of things that works beautifully with industrial craft and with... I'm going to take that chicken that was new. And with build craft, working with the pipes and everything, additional pipes. It does work really nicely. Maybe it's, two, maybe it's more like a two-to-one ratio. I, I can't see it's a good. lot more than I am. Maybe because it's uh, the amount of energy put in. And that could be something as well. I doubt it, it because the, the, the leaves fall on their own. The machine doesn't force them to yeah, fall that's as true. far as I know. I was just thinking maybe it has something to do. There, there might be like an efficiency ratio. Like if you power it with low efficiency engines. It probably, it's probably not. And, uh, probably. I totally be wrong. Not. But, you know, hey, it might be. <laughs> you never know. Never. Well, we could actually make this to code. where, um, yeah, that's true. No, we could actually make that to where it does have some sort of uh, uh, machine, like a, like a item detector block or whatever. So basically, it goes through, and if you had it set up on some sort of cycle, to where it said, all right, it's going to put the catalyst in for you know twenty, thirty seconds, and then it's going to take it out for three minutes or something like that. And then puts it back in. I mean, you could do something like that. This is short rain. Yeah. But, I mean, that would be something that would be pretty cool if you had it to where, just to make sure your catalyst doesn't get all used up and everything like that, make it more efficient. Have it to where your... The catalyst gets put into the I don't the, think the, the catalyst even gets used up. That's something I haven't been seeing. Like, mine, I have 15 in there, and it hasn't used a single one of them. Really? Yeah. Like here, all these trees are about to grow in a couple seconds after this thing starts warming up, and it'll still have 12 catalyst in there. I'm gonna watch this. Like that, I think it's a glitch, which it's kind of a nice glitch because you didn't, then you don't have to make any more catalyst. But right, right. So and all the trees, trees, bam, and yeah, it didn't use any catalyst, and it's also not prop uh, processing like here in the middle. Nope. Hmm. Huh. That's pretty you cool. Know what? I bet you've got a, already got a crap ton of sicky resin. Let's go see. <laughs> that was cheating, Chris. <laughs> Did he have twenty nine sticky home? resin? Twenty nine sticky resin. Now we just need an extractor. <laughs> 15 sand. So basically you're getting about two sticky resin per tree. I heard an enderman. Yep, right down here. You guys want to attack an enderman? Crap. I see him. I hear him. Ah. How is he on fire? What are you doing on fire? I killed him. I win. How What's did my he get prize? on fire? I don't know. He was on fire though. Oh, that engine. It exploded. What? This one right here. Oh, it, ooh, it's about to. Why the hell is it exploded? Good thinking. You're welcome. Two of them. Two of them. Here, just go turn the entire system off. That'd be better for it. Yeah, can you go hit the switch up there, Chris? This is the same thing that happened in uh, Knight's house, except he got attacked by his engine. <laughs> like, literally, his engine started attacking him, and he started dying. Alright. Calm down. Calm down. Dude, it's all of them on this, on this left side. Odd. Very odd. Huh. We're going to have to check into that. Yeah. Okay. All right, guys. Well, we will figure that out. And uh, if you have any knowledge on 
why that does that. Uh, that one engine, is it all the way around or is it just that row? Looks just like it's that just row. that row. <clears throat> hmm. If you have any knowledge or insights on why that might be happening, happening on just one row of our system, uh, put it in a comment below. Let us know. Uh, we're going to try to figure it out as well, but at a later time, because I have to go to work here in about five hours. So, uh, yeah, we're going to go ahead and cut this one off. I saw us making the forestry mod. We went through and did the uh, rubber tree farm, powered up by our 360 MEP, uh, 360 valve MEP, and, yeah, good episode. Any comments or last uh, little remarks you guys got? I'm tired and hungry. I'm not yet next year. All right. Oh, you had constructive comments, my bad. Yeah, yeah, typically, you know. Okay, I'm sorry. Fail. All right, guys, well, we're going to go ahead and cut it off. Like usual, I am Dream River 23. LMP 33. Tired. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Steven, my bad. And we will see you next time. Make sure you guys comment, subscribe, uh, leave a message. Definitely comment about the engines. If you know anything about those engines, that's kind of bothersome. I don't want the 360 MEP to blow up. So, anyways, guys, thank you guys for watching, and we will see you next time. Bye, guys. Clicky, clicky the like button. Uh, mm, yes, clicky the like button.